Hi. Today we're going to be working on this. Uh, it's an LG Flatron uh, 22 inch, 2230. Um, uh, classic problem. Screen comes on for two seconds, two three seconds, and then uh, the backlight switch off. The power button stays on, but uh, the backlight switch off. So uh, I've taken off the back cover here. Um, check the capacitors on the inverter board. This is your inverter board over here. Okay, so your inverter board, you have the inverter board which gives the two, um, the output to the two uh, CCFL lamps. One runs along the bottom, one, run, one uh, lamp uh, goes across the top. Um, check the board, check the outputs of the um, inverter, everything's okay. But uh, the screen was still switching off. Um, if your inverter board's okay, uh, the only other option would be the actual CCFL lamps. Okay, so unfortunately, to get to the CCFL lamps, you've got to remove your panel. Okay, it's a little bit of a risky job. You take out your panel, and I found the CCFL lamp that runs along the top of the screen. Okay, so this is upside down now. Alright, so the CCFL lamp that runs along the top of the screen, the, uh, the cable on the far end was uh, arcing, had a bad contact and um, what happens is the inverter board has a chip which um, it recognizes that this is a fault and to prevent fires or whatever it uh, just switches off the, the lamp, switches off the lamps, it's a safety mechanism. Okay, so I removed the I removed the lamp out okay the lamp sort of looks like this okay I removed the lamp out one of the sides was black was burnt resolded on the the wire re insulated it and then put the lamp back in so I didn't replace the lamp just resolded it re insulated it put it back in okay so right now we have let me just power it on So right now we just have the the backlights, the reflector panel. Okay, so let's just power it on. And there you go. So the backlights come on and they stay on. Okay. So um, what's left to do now, refit the, the LCD panel. And um, this... Uh, the screen's back on the road. Um, you'll normally find the lamp that does get damaged is the one that runs along the top of the screen because um, the heat rises up to the top and uh, normally from, from the heat um, you get that sort of damage. So in this case it wasn't the inverter board, wasn't the capacitors, bad connection on the CCFL tube. Um, it's a little bit uh, technical to get to it, resolder it, but uh, if you can do it, you can uh, you can recover your your screen. Okay, so let me put the panel back in, and then we'll switch it on again. Okay, so uh, got the screen back together. It's been on for half an hour or so, so uh, it's working absolutely perfectly. There's no flickering of the lamps. Um, it definitely was just a bad connection on that CCFL lamp. Um, if you're having a problem, similar problem to mine, where you don't believe it's the inverter board or the capacitors, if you can get your hands on another CCFL lamp like this one, that you can just plug it in to the board. In other words, you leave one in, remove one, and plug this in to see if you can get it to stay on. Uh, if you can do that, you can isolate uh, which lamps causing the problem, as well as confirm that it's one of the the lamps that are causing the screen to the backlights to switch off. Okay, so no spare parts were in, uh, were required in this repair. So just a bit of time, a bit of labour. So that's good and cheap. Um, nice easy fix. Okay, remember there's always a fix. Thanks for watching.